Hey there YouTube, it's Nick with Feeding Fitness and it is All You Can Eat Wednesday. So uh, we'll get started right away. Um, it's almost noon, I woke up a little bit later than I intended to, but that's the life of the night shift worker I guess. So today is going to be kind of a weird day. I'm supposed to be off of work, but I'm so lucky I get to go to work to do an Ebola training drill. So I have to go to work um, for I don't know how many hours um, and it's in the afternoon so we'll see. Um, so I gotta wake up early so I can go to the gym early. Um, well not wake up early, like I said I woke up at noon I wanted to wake up early but I didn't. So long story short, it's noon, I need to go to the gym now and here's what I'm gonna eat before I go. This brownie is made of protein powder and beans, um, black beans. It is not my recipe. I will put a link in the description, but um, it's somebody else's recipe, so I, I won't make a separate video. Um, and light and fit, peach flavor. So uh, I need to hurry up and eat this and hit the gym, and um, we'll see what, I, what else I get into on this kind of unusual day. All right, done with the gym. Um, like I said, I've got to go into work this afternoon, and I don't know for how long. Um, uh, for those of you who don't know, I do live in northeastern Ohio, and unless you've been living under a rock, we've had quite an Ebola scare here. I'm also a nurse at a hospital, and I work in intensive care, so I need to potentially be prepared to take care of a patient with Ebola. So our hospital is going to run a drill today, and um, that's why I have to go into work in the afternoon. I don't know how long the drill is going to take, and I don't know how long I'll be there, um, but I know it's going to involve putting on and off uh, protective equipment and just simply simulating what would happen if someone came into our emergency room that we suspected had Ebola. So I need to be actually ready for this. Um, this could happen. So um, I'm not going to get into that anymore um, because I don't think it has anything to do with the channel, but I just wanted to let you guys know that's why I'm going into work in the afternoon. So um, I'm just going to have a homemade Quest Style protein bar. Uh, pumpkin flavor. This will be delicious and have a lot of protein and fiber in it. So um, I don't know when or what I'm going to eat after this. So just hang on and we'll find out. Okay, I am back home. That mean was uh, a little bit longer than I thought. It was very thorough. I feel very comfortable about everything, you know, being at work. Um, so back to the food. Um, I need to get in a pretty big meal here because it's 7 o'clock and I've only eaten what you've seen so far. So didn't feel like cooking chipotle carnitas tacos, chipotle steak burrito, and monster uh, zero calorie energy drink. This will help get the calories in quickly and deliciously. So good. That chipotle was just right, hit the spot, just what I needed, um, tasted amazing. So, um, I, I usually almost always have ice cream after I have my main meal. Well, I'm um, not going to have like ice cream ice cream, but I'll show you. Klondike bar, ice cream bars. This is Fudge Crunch, it's like a chocolate on chocolate, pretty good. Macros aren't horrible. 180 calories, 10 fat. Uh, 22 carb, 2 protein, so I'm going to go ahead and have one of these. Alright, carrying on, it's about 9.20, um, and I'll show you what I've got now. This is just some vegetable soup. Uh, my fiance made it. We had a bunch of vegetables in the house uh, that were just going to go bad, so she threw this together. It's tomatoes and zucchini. There's some pasta in there. There's some beans in there. Um, onions. Um, I think that might be it. Carrots also. So figured out the macros for all those individually, and that'll be in my MyFitnessPal link in the description. And with that, I'm also gonna have some Quaker white cheddar rice cakes. I'll have half a pack, which is seven. Um, so if you've been following so far, whole, whole lot of sodium today. Just the Chipotle alone is five grams of sodium, which is a ton. So here's the deal with sodium. I'm not hypertensive. I don't have to specifically avoid sodium for any reason, but I need to know um, and not be totally shocked when my weight jumps tomorrow or the next day. My weight is going to go up a few pounds because of this, but it's just the sodium and I know that because it's an unusually high sodium day for me. So uh, again, sodium is not something to worry about unless you have to worry about it. So, um, but just know that weight's gonna go up. All right, random assortment of snacks coming up. 
Camet Puffs, three servings with one serving of s'mores protein and bananas cut up in there. My last caramel apple pie Greek yogurt. I haven't been able to find any more. I don't know if they're done for the season or what. I love these, um, but this is the last one I've got on hand. Hopefully I find more. Um, two of those pumpkin cheesecake cookies. I keep making these because I love them. They're high in protein. They're low in everything else, low calorie. These are great. And a single cheese stick. All right, guys, a little bit after midnight. Gonna have my last uh, last food item of the night, and we're gonna make it an awesome one. We're gonna have a little apple pie waffle. So what you have here is your uh, typical waffle that I make, which is just pancake mix, protein powder, egg whites, and um, and syrup. And then you've got some apples. I cut the, just an apple. I cut up, put um, apple pie apple pie spice on in microwave, and then some fat-free Ready Whip on the top. So that's gonna be it for the day. Let's check out our totals. So 33, 39 for the calories, 61 remaining, that's fine. And there's all the food. Just not what I wanted to go to. <laughs> I think after like three years, I'd know how to use this app. <laughs> And these will be the totals of the new day. Ah, there we go. All right, 72 fat, perfect. 478 carbs with 69 fiber and 210 protein. Everything is right where it needs to be, and now I get to go enjoy that guy. So, hope you liked this week's All You Can Eat Wednesday. There'll be another one next week. Um, if you like the video, do give it a thumbs up. Helps people find the channel. Um, and if you like these videos, please subscribe. I do them every Wednesday along with uh, videos in between of um, just about anything. If you have suggestions for topics uh, that you want to see me cover, please put them in the comments down below. Or if there's foods or things you'd like me to try, you can put that in the comments down below. Join us at Facebook at facebook.com upslash feedingfitness. And I'll see you guys next time.